Hello my fellow sniffers, welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new to my channel Yes, there's a crazy cat like flying around if you want to know why Check out my other vlogs. They're gonna be a lot different than what I'm about to tell you guys now If you follow me on Instagram at Marlene McCohen, you probably know what this update is about but to get everybody up to date I lost my bird. He's my favorite bird. He's my mustache parakeet. I know I'm reiterating, but there's a lot of new people here recently, which I'm pretty excited about. But I am heartbroken, and I've been updating my sniffers, as I call you guys, on what's been happening. And for those of you who are completely new here, check out all my funny videos. And for those of you who are waiting for updates on Picasso, let me tell you what just happened. I just spoke with an animal intuitive, and this is the second time I've spoken with somebody about Picasso. And since you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably have been waiting for this message because I saw some of you looking for the update. And for those of you who are wondering about things in between videos, it's a really good idea to follow me on Instagram and watch my IGTV, which is Instagram TV, because I'm finding it to be so helpful in keeping you guys updated in between videos and I'm gonna continue to do that all the time and also I've been doing life with the parrots and crazy life with the birds there so you don't want to miss out on that unedited action okay so back to the intuitive she was amazing first of all this is the second time I've spoken to someone and both of them said that Picasso is alive and well. Now, for those of you who don't believe in things like this, hear me out. These kind of things give me such a new hope and a new energy and a new drive to do something new to find Picasso because when you lose a bird, it can get really exhausting. Any animal, it's heartbreaking, it's exhausting, it's tiring, it's tiring emotionally. So just having a little bit of new hope and good news, even though there is no clear evidence of good news, makes me feel really, really good. So here's what happened she had emailed me and I hadn't gotten back to her because I just have hundreds of emails from you guys and I appreciate them so much and you guys are writing such amazing things like unbelievable like if Picasso wasn't missing I don't think I would even know what an army of incredible souls you are I mean I knew but just like I don't know I, I just love you guys so much more now and I feel like we're such a strong team and um, I read her email and I meant to get back to her, like I mean to get back to a lot of you and I will. And then I forgot about it and then she emailed me again and in it she wrote, really, I just wanna reach out again for the sake of Picasso. And I just, she donated her time and I just feel like, I just felt the love, her love for animals and her love for um, Picasso in general and her empathy so I contacted her and I spoke to her for a very long time today and um, she gave me a disclaimer she was like I could be wrong and um, I don't know I actually have a really good feeling when I responded to her she gave me details on where she thinks he might have gone and she said I don't know are there stores near you is there like a main street with lots of stores and she doesn't live anywhere near me and that made me, before I even responded to her, I went and put up flyers, if you saw on Instagram TV, with a reward last night along the boulevard. So then I spoke to her today and she's like, I see a white sign with blue writing and I don't know. And it was really weird. She said, I see like folded clothing or fabrics and things like that. And um, basically, after she sent me that email, before she told me about the fabric and the sign, I said, ah, oh, there's kind of a cleaners nearby. I wonder if, um, you know, that would be somewhere he could go. Like, I just got this vibe. And then when I called her, she was like, I don't know if there's a sign near you. Maybe you could look on Google Earth. And sure enough, when I got this instinct to like check that sign, it's white with blue writing. And there's other details she gave me, but long story short, 
that was just confirmation for me that that could be at least the right direction just that the sign matched exactly what she was describing and on top of that it matched like where I thought maybe that could be the direction based on her first email to me her second email or her third email sorry anyway I'm gonna keep this short I'm gonna go out today and I'm gonna start over there and I'm gonna bring some flyers and I may need some help so if any of you are in the area and you want to help don't feel free to email me um, I need to get things up I need to get to every store legitimately in my town and see if I can get any leads and there are people that literally are not good with the internet they don't speak English like they just may not know how to get Picasso back or a lot of people just want to keep birds until they know who it belongs to so I'm changing my whole direction now and I'm working on the stores and the businesses if anyone wants to help me let me know if you live in the area obviously and um, and that goes for my friends too and I'm feeling very hopeful and very positive and I don't know I just like things have changed tomorrow's my birthday I'm not saying I'll find him before tomorrow but I really didn't think I'd have to spend my birthday without my bird um, my beloved bird like my bird that I love so much and I don't even know what's gonna happen but that's the story tomorrow is my birthday guys and I wanted to give you guys a little update cats here cats still here what are you doing here but not near the birds the cat actually like has already kind of picked her room and it's kind of like she likes upstairs don't know if I'm keeping the cat I'm just saying and for those of you curious about the cat um, there is a potential really good home for the cat so it's not like she would be abandoned by me she's getting a lot of love but George is in love with the cat so that's the cat story I love you guys so so much I can't even convey I'm feeling very positive I don't know if I'll get a birthday miracle I do need some help but I think that I don't know I just intuitively feel like now we're going in the right direction so that is all I'm not gonna edit this sorry guys I just want to get it up I just want to get to Picasso quickly I love you so much don't forget to subscribe hashtag bring Picasso home and thank you guys on Instagram for all of the accounts because I think they're so amazing maybe you guys could tag businesses now in Encino Tarzana Sherman Oaks I don't know I love you guys um, that's it don't forget to follow me on Instagram because you're really missing out I love you guys Bye.